So this is the Birch uh, TS Ultra motorcycle motor. It's got uh, 150 kilowatts of peak power, so that's 200 horsepower. Also 1,200 newton meters of uh, torque and uh, only a weight of uh, 21 kilos. So that's roughly like half the weight as, a, as you would have in a typical or a conventional in-wheel motor. Uh, so lightweight is very important in a motorcycle, so that's why we've uh, compressed everything as, as compact as possible to bring the weight down and also bring the cost down. So as the overall structure uh, on the inside, there's the stationary bit and on the outside, there's the rotating bit. So now obviously it's glued to the stand here, but I can show like uh, basically this is the bearing point. Uh, so everything on the inside is stationary on the motorcycle. So you have a, a swing arm connection points and a brake caliper connection and those kind of things. And everything else is just a maximized uh, surface area for the air cooling. So there's no liquid cooling in the whole motor, this is all air-cooled. And uh, these are additional seal plates which house a basically a lip seal preventing any, any water or dirt going into the motor. And then everything else is the rotating part. So this is a composite uh, which houses the permanent magnets. So the lowest amount of uh, rotational mass as possible and then maximized uh, surface area on the inside for cooling.